Hey everybody, it's Joe the UCX guy, and I'm here with three Nortel T7316s. Why do I have three of them all set up together? Well, I wanted to talk today about how the IP Office and the UCX from eMetrotel are both considered replacements for the Nortel BCM and Northstar series. So I kind of wanted to give a brief overview, a little bit of differences between the phones and how they operate. Um, so this phone right here is connected to my IP office, which is right down here. Um, this phone is a North Star phone, BCM phone, connected to my BCM, which is right here, which you can't really see in the light. And then this phone is connected to my UCX from eMetrotel, which Callisto is a proud partner and seller of this system. I have a little bit older of a box for them. Um, but there's a bunch of new models created so uh, from eMetrotel. So let's just see how calls come in on these phones. I, I just want to kind of give you a brief overview. If you look at this uh, IP office phone, uh, let's make a call to it. We're calling from the UCX. It gives you information on the screen to voicemail, ignore um, some of the more common Avaya type features. So if I answer that, uh, some of the common features still work, like feature 7.0, which would uh, transfer it. And then I hit complete, and it's kind of all the Avaya terminology. I pick that up, hang that up. Um, so that's a little bit how this phone works. It's pretty similar to the North Star and BCM, but also um, more in lines with the Avaya product. Like, Let's say I want to do feature 630 for paging. I can't do that. Um, I actually have to go to uh, and dial a feature code or a key, as they call um, short codes. Test page one, two, test one, two. And that's how you do it on the IP office. You can't really do a feature 630. So a lot of the codes that you're familiar with don't work, like background music no longer works. Um, you know, feature 74. Um, it doesn't work. Parking doesn't work the same way on this. Uh, let's give it a call. We'll answer. And let's see. Parking. I don't know how it works. Let's, feature 74. So it parks it on the extension and then you have to pick it up. There's no 101 or 102 or 501, 502, that kind of thing. So let's look over here at the BCM phone, which you're all familiar with. Um, you know, it has its common features like feature star six for, for the uh, ringer. When I get a call to it, I'm going to call from the UCX to it. Uh, I don't know if I have a program, but we'll try it here. Uh, I don't think I have a program to call that, but if you see you get a call here, let's call into the system. We'll call into the BCM, and I'll hit feature 75. Now I have the call, and obviously you're familiar, Nortel features are here on the screen, info, transfer, and um, if you want to do your feature 74 for park, it's still there, and you can have the option to page both. Bill, you have a call parked on 501, Bill, 501. So that call is still on hold, and then you can go to any phone and pick up, let's see, what did I do, 501? There we go. So now that brings us over here to the UCX T7316. And this phone um, is pretty similar, unlike the counterpart from the IP office, which conforms more to Avaya standards. This one conforms more to the former Nortel standards. Um, so let's say I get a call to this phone. Uh, let's just try giving a call from the IP office over to this phone. Okay, I'm getting a call from the IP office. See, I'm getting answer or ignore. But actually, once I accept the call, I have an option to transfer or conference it. Um, now, if I actually get a call from the outside, We're calling over here from the IP office. Good day. We'll Thank call you for this calling phone. Joe's 
You can see what happens on the display. So I have the option to answer, and just like the Nortel phones, I have the option to hit info, and I get the caller ID number. I also have an additional option to conference. On the on Northstar BCM, you just have the transfer soft key. And um, let's make another call to this phone. Now, if I answer it, parking is amazing. Watch this. It parks just like the Nortel phones on the Northstar system. Parked on 525, so you can set up your own park zone, and then you can pick it up the same way you would on a Northstar. So it's very similar. Um, there's also feature codes for paging that are very similar. Let's do feature 611 for paging. Test page one, one, two, test one, one, two. Two. So if you notice, you can do your feature 611. I set up feature 611 for overhead and 612 for phone speakers. Test, test page, page one, two, two, test, test one, two. two. It's paging page the phones over there. So that's very similar, similar to Nortel. Um, and I also wanted to show how this phone operates um, very similar in the fact that when you get, um, let's get a call back to this phone. And then when you go to transfer it, let's transfer it. You also have this option to hit cancel, which brings it right back. But then, then you press the transfer again, comes back to that phone over there, but we're done with that call. And one other cool little feature, um, let's say you're on another call. Let's just say we called that extension. And I get another call on that phone. Voila, I have call buzz um, and call waiting. So that's something you never had on the um, Northstar platform. And, and an additional feature that you have with this connected to the, uh, the UCX from eMetrotel. So that's a little brief introduction between the uh, actual three phones. Remember, IP office, the display is a little different your typical Nortel display, and the very similar display on the UCX from eMetrotel. Thanks, I'm Joe the UCX guy, and for Callisto, have a great day.